Yes, good evening, good morning, wonderful people of Biafra, lovers of freedom. Welcome to this program this evening as it is hot, Biafra Television. We are streaming live and direct from about eight platforms. We are live on Biafra Television. We are live on Prince Darlington's walls. We are live on Barista Ifanye your first wall. We are live on as it is hot, Biafra Television on YouTube. We are live on Exodus Biafra Television. We are also live on so many platforms. And this evening with me in the studio is a barrister, Ifan Yichuku Ejofo, the barrister, attorney at law, and the lead counsel of Mazit Nam De Kano, whom I promise each and every one of you that is going to come on this platform to update Biafrans and speak to us from time to time. He was on this platform last time and he promised to come back again because he loves Biafran so much, just as Martin Lamdekano loves each and every one of us. And this evening, this morning, this afternoon, depending on your location, I want you to share this program and invite your friends to come and hear from this horse's mouth. That is why I tell you that when you want to follow anybody, follow the person that knows road. The man that is seen Martin Lamdekano one on one, the man that discussed with him whenever he visited him. The lead counsel, whatsoever information you are getting from Barrister Ifan Ijofor is authentic, one, and not two. He doesn't lie. He doesn't know how to lie because lying is not in his dictionary. Therefore, this evening, brothers and sisters, as you are joining us from all the platforms where we are broadcasting this evening, I want you to know that Barrister Ifan Ijofor is a man of his word. He promised to be here, and due to some circumstances surrounding his movement and entangled with other things he's doing, he was not able to visit us to come here two days ago, but today he is finally here. He is a very busy lawyer. He has a whole lot in his hand. And therefore, please, he is here live and direct. Barista Ifan Ichuku Ejofo is here live and direct. And those of you who that want to ask questions or that want to contribute to this program, please keep your question by the side. For now, the person that I have brought to this program this evening, as promised, is no other person but Mazi Barista Onyo Kibe. If I you chuku a job for yeah, welcome to this program. This uh, our barrister, the man that is so much handsome that I love so much. Please speak to Biafra. Yeah, friends, good evening, good morning, good afternoon, depending on the location you find yourself at this point in time. Um, it's a pleasure having me in this platform. Uh, I want to thank Prince Valentin for his efforts and also all those of you who have remained results. So as men on checking, even in this trying period, uh, I, God is with us and God shall, shall continue to be with us. Thank you for having me. Uh, my apologies for my unavoidable absence few days ago. A lot of time, my hands are slightly pointed out. So um, I assured him I'll be here today to give people a brief, um, a brief um, facts as regards to what we are passing through and also uh, the the condition of my client and leader of IPOB. So thank you so much for having me. Very bless. Thank you very much, Barista. Barista I must tell you something. Please permit me to say this: that you are. <laughs> when you told us you are coming, my inbox was raining with messages. Is he coming? Is he coming? Because you are the eyes which Biafrans are using to see right now as in the heart. 
You know, say this platform is called as the hub. So they were so much hurry, they they what they needed you. So now that you are here, be France, one of go barista, barista, I will speedily go to ask you just about few questions because I know that you have a whole lot of um, entanglement with other uh, arrangements and uh, meetings here and there. Please, first and foremost, please. Uh, the first question I want to ask you this evening is uh, I want you to tell us how is Mazin Namdekanu. Uh, uh, um, how is he, why, how is he, how strong is Mazen Namdekano in physical and uh, in the spiritual? Please, uh, they try to tell Biafra because they want to know his mental stability. Uh, thank you so much. I am um, yesterday when I wanted to uh, issue an update, I want to make a kind of a digress from this topic and also to emphasize on, on my commitment and obligations. So my, my head of chambers was like, uh, oh God, why should we be updating the people? I said, no, they, are, they, are, they have to know. I uh, in line with my promises because they want to understand, want to have to be told about how he's doing. And also if anything, as I show them, if at any point in time, things are not going normal, I will allow the word. I'm not afraid of anybody. So, and um, in keeping in line with that promises, I will continue to, update you. I will continue to keep you informed as regards to his uh, state of health, condition, and also what's happening around him, particularly those that are supposed to be made public. Uh, so um, yesterday, I was with him yesterday. I, we, had a very, we had a very elaborate discussion yesterday, and then um, he's firm, stable, and also strong in his conviction, as I pointed out. Unfortunately, and ironically, he's very, 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 very resolute. Strong, when I mean strong, I mean strong in its convictions. And also unshaken in all sense of faith. So, uh, and when I compare or contrast what I'm seeing about the social media, how people are panicking, I was like, I wish uh, you can see people, how people are panicking about you. But it's very, very strong and very, very, very high in spirit. Uh, I can confirm that to people. So there's no cause for alarm. Uh, uh, at any point in time, I suspect or I observe anything going on wrongly, I am under compelling obligation to inform the world. It's my duty to do that. And of course, trust me, I will, I will, trust me, I will do just that. So thank you so much. Thank you very much, Barista. Thank God that you saw him yesterday. So you are the eyes which Biafran's worldwide are using to see our leader right now. Because the other time they were saying, uh, snap picture, do video, do this, but those things are not applicable. It's not... Uh, I, 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 I told them, because some people are saying, let me correct this narrative, it's wrong, wrong impression. I don't know why our people find it difficult to understand a simple instruction on, say, or simple explanation. I made it known to people during our last uh, discussion on this platform, that in view of the environment, uh, our clients presently be in the town, they are not allowed you to come in with any form of gadget, even watch. You don't put on watch while going in there, so you will not have any 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 opportunity of snapping any from any picture or doing any, any of such thing with him. So, but I've told them, I've told them that I will be telling them nothing but the truth. And I was saying it as blunt as it may look. So if he's not doing well, I will say it to the world. Uh, so we have other arrangements, other discussions within that has nothing to do with, uh, that cannot be discussed on this platform. That's, that are pure legal, legal strategies, so which are meant for our thing. And we, are, we have taken it up from that, uh, that aspect. So he's doing well. And uh, I wouldn't want people to be telling me, or oh, God, snap picture with him, or oh, God, do video with him. <laughs> Fuck, I'll know it. No, no, no. So once you hear from me, believe me, he's good. Uh, yeah. So uh, he's good. He's not good, I'll tell you. So simple. Thank you. Beautiful. Thank you very much for that clarification because uh, as known in Makawaru, Egewaru, Numo Biafra, you guys have heard it that you cannot even go in with ordinary wristwatch uh, to go and see uh, um, anybody that is detained at the, at the DSS uh, office. Uh, Barrister, um, we all know quite right that uh, the court is on vacation right now. Uh, the world, Biafra's at large, would like to know uh, what are the measures that you are putting together, you and your team, uh, putting together to see what you can do uh, in regards to 
he uh, keeping him there because we cannot wait. You cannot wait. Biafrans are impatient. Our patient is already running away from us. We are, we are, we are, we are, we are not, we are not going to wait until that uh, is it October or September when they say they are going to bring him. So, what are the measures that uh, the team are putting together to see if uh, there's how they can bring him out uh, to speak to Biafrans during this vacation period, if it's possible? Please go ahead and give us elaborate on that. Give, elaborate on that, please, sir. Thank you so much. Um, we had envisaged this situation on 26th of July, 2021, the matter came up when it was not produced in court. And uh, we informed the court about our desire to show that this matter is hard during vacation. In view of the sensitive nature of the matter, in view of um, is also his um, the condition, because uh, we also want him to be taken good care of. Uh, we, we respect him, respect his position, respect him, honor him too. So we don't want him to be kept in, in incarceration at the infinitum. So uh, we, we, that application was made before the court on that day. Formally, I made it in court. And the court uh, expressed his um, readiness, to, readiness to, to oblige us even during this vacation. So I'm directed that we should apply to CJ for fiat because she can only sit upon being granted fiat uh, upon the authority of the CJ. We are the fact, we are the fact that we are on vacation. So, and that has been done. And uh, we are following up. We are following up expeditiously. And uh, I believe um, in the next couple of um, days or thereabouts, I uh, will inform you, give you, come out with a positive uh, response to this effect. Uh, but I'm sure that um, I believe God firmly that um, something will happen any month from now. And uh, so I can, we can go back to court. So, we want to go back. We are, we are very desirous of going back to court as quick as possible even during this vacation, and we have initiated the process towards, towards, towards doing that. So I uh, believe in God that um, that will be feasible. It will be feasible, more especially when the court has expressed a readiness to, to, to be available for this trial during the vacation. So, because that will have been our only impediment. But my Lord said, if you, fall, you can apply, apply once the fiat is granted, I will be here to conduct the trial. And also, also the director of the, the prosecution to do that. But you know they will not do it because they're not, even if the matter didn't go on, it's not their business. So, but we have done it on our own part. So we are following up. Thank you. So, obviously, any moment from now, I will come back to you with a very wonderful and a positive response to that effect. Beautiful. Thank you very much, Barrister. Please, I want you to um, elaborate just a little bit more because some people may not understand all these. Uh, all these terminologies, all these legal terminologies, please. Just, mm -hmm. I want you to break it down a little bit. Okay, you know, our... okay let me come, okay, let let me me come back to the... Let, let me, me tell come you back the, to the man. Let me uh, tell you the area I want you to touch, please. Okay, okay. So that you come down to layman language so that they will understand. The area I want okay. you to touch is now that everybody knows that court is on vacation. Uh, mm -hmm. I want you to explain to us if um, in the constitution of the country, once a court is on vacation, is there, a, 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 um, is there a, 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 should I say, an opportunity or should I say a cross that court can hold even when they are there in, uh, in vac on vacation or not? Uh, you know, just explain this because some people will say, since court is on vacation, what are we talking about bringing him to court? Because everybody is thinking that it is until that date when court opened that they are going to bring him. So what is the possibility? Okay, ordinarily, when courts and vacation. Subsisting matters, as in matter going on, matters going on in courts will be suspended. Okay. Apart from cases they classified as matters that can be had during vacations, like fundamental rights suits or matters of urgency, uh, mm -hmm. like, and also probably a little, uh, little petition matters. So, so these are matters that can be entertained by the vacation judge during vacation. So, mm -hmm. and of course, in our own case, the matter has been on since 2015 before, the, before our client was abducted in Kenya on 19th of June and brought okay. to this place and smuggled in through a surgical transition. So, uh, but that, does, that is not uh, the end of it because the court can only sit in cases such as ours as with the permission of the CJ. That permission is what we call fiat in Lego Palace. Fiat permission, the facility will give the courts go ahead, go and sit here. This case during vacation, so the and the, the court required the permission, the approval of the CJ to go and do that because it's not uh, it's not conventional for the court to do it, to see during vacation apart from vacation courts. Uh, so, 
And that permission is what the court has directed us to apply for. And we have applied for it in line with the provisions of the law. Because even the law, the, 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 the rules of court allows us to make such application for court to direct our Lord, my Lord handling this matter to sit. So we have done that. So, and once that permission or approval, you call, whatever you call it, approval or permission is given to the Honorable Justice Nyako to sit on this case, that is final. The court will start sitting during the vacation. But when refused, if refused, assuming in the unlikely event that the application is refused, then we we'll have to wait till October 21st to come back to court. So, but um, I don't think uh, there will be any reason for refusal because the court expressed. The court told us in court, my Lord told us in court, I mean, the judge told us in court that, uh, that she's ready to hear this application, to hear to conduct this trial, as in to go on with this trial during vacation. So that is the fundamental factor to be considered. Because if the court is not disposed towards hearing the application or hearing the suit during vacation, then the CJ may not possibly impose uh, direct the judge to go ahead against us. So, so the court was to be rested now. So the court told us in open court that she's ready to hear it during this vacation. So that should have been the the fundamental factor to be considered by the honorable CJ at the point of um, uh, considering application for fiat. So for that permission. So and I believe um, I believe uh, there will be most certainly positive outcome. So or better as aside this, I ordinarily. Uh, it's not a matter of course for court to sit during vacation because vacation has been declared. Vacation is just like a public holiday. So, and uh, when this is it's public holiday is for the courts. Yeah, so this is the time for them to go and rest for 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 a, for a particular period of time. So within that period, they will use it to some use to travel, attend to their medical health, to their to their uh, personal needs, and also uh, also read books too. So uh, it's not the time for them to go back to court apart from judges appointed to sit on vacation. There are judges appointed to sit on vacation, during vacation. So this is the, uh, uh, this is the situation. So I believe that I'm, I've been able to uh, explain the manner how people understand. Or should I speak in Igbo language for them to understand? I hope I've done, I've done it, I've done justice to this explanation. The manner they will understand it. Or should I go in Igbo language or, 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 are you with me? Hello? Hello? Are you hearing me? I'm not. You're not talking. Talented, you're not talking. Sorry, sorry, Barrister. I'm very, very sorry about that um, network uh, uh, little uh, um, intermittent, please. I'm very, very sorry about that, please. Uh, please, dear friends, forgive us. You all know that um, this is electronics. Sometimes it may function. So, Biafra, um, Barrister, haven't answered all that, please. I have another question to throw to you. And this question is talking about um, uh, to proceed, you know, um, the international court on this uh, on this issue, this particular pro, uh, uh, case we are handling right now, or Mazenam the Kano, what do you think, and how are your team going to handle this case before the international uh, proceedings? Because people have known that Mazenam the Kano was abducted in a, in a different country and brought him and brought to Nigeria, and that is called um, extraordinary rendition. And I believe that international law has something to do with this. So are we, what are we expecting 
from this illegal luminary? Are we expecting that we be talking about the charges they gave to him and leave the 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 the, the case that the crime that they have committed, which is a, a extraordinary rendition of Mazen Namdekan back to Nigeria? So I, I want you to please throw a little bit light to this so that dear friends may understand what is happening because myself I'm not very happy about it. Okay, thank you. Um, what I will say now is that uh, I have to be conscious of a number of things in response to this uh, question. One, uh, I wouldn't want us to continue to exposing our strategies before the public, uh, particularly the legal teams we have agreed to be circumspect of um, uh, our things, our disclosures to the public, because this program now is being listened to even by the people uh, we are also in court with, of course, you know. So um, mm -hmm. what I can tell you at this stage is that um, our partners, Blindsman and Co, and also are on it. Uh, actions are being taken, even in Kenya. Uh, 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 and also are being maintained also in International Criminal Court. Because what happened in Kenya on 19th of uh, June, 2021, is a gross violation of humanitarian laws. Uh, United Nations Conventions, and also Geneva, Geneva Treaty, which Nigeria adopted uh, and signed in 2001. So uh, uh, we have a clear laid down law for extracting persons who are accused of committing an offense in a foreign, in a foreign land. So uh, that's, that matter has been overlabeled. That, um, uh, the, that law that we leveled in our several um, interviews uh, and also media uh, discussions. Uh, so, we, the Nigeria and Kenya uh, uh, committed a serious uh, uh, crime because it's a crime. Because and they wish uh, we have um, uh, we have invited relevant uh, uh, international agencies to investigate. Uh, so, and they've been investigated as I speak to you now. So, and uh, in the course of investigating them, we also have to be very conscious of things we say to avoid uh, prejudicing what they are doing, as I speak to you. And uh, so, because uh, it's a very slow, uh, uh, it's a very slow matter. It's a very slow matter, and uh, which is a very, uh, this is a very slow concern too. And um, I'm happy with the response of the international community, despite the, 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 uh, the lukewarm attitude of the British authority, uh, because I've several accused them of collaboration in this uh, case, but I don't want to go into details because I know um, all these things, the facts now, the disposal will come, will come in the open because of time. Uh, so we will maintain, we have maintained uh, our partners also, uh, and my partners in UK and also US, and um, and other places in Germany too. They are, we have maintained several uh, uh, legal actions against them. Uh, against the corporates in this in this uh, instance so so i may i may not i may i may i may seek and also I, I apologize for not going further than this uh because of um a number of reasons i've been able to highlight here um, and, and my introductory said because i wouldn't want us to be discussing strategies for adopting at international in space and it's all right. handling gross violation of um his fundamental rights so, it's all right. So I I Thank you so much. I understand that. So Please, um, much, much there is something, there is something I beautiful. I trust, I trust you. And there is something that is bothering me. You know, this is a plus to the question I intended to ask you. I watched a video where uh, President Muhammad Buhari went to uh, United Nations and was conversing for the freedom of Western, the people of Western Sahara and them. Um, Palestinian to stand as a state, they ask telling the world that um, they have rights for self determination and nobody should stop them from you know from you know exercising their rights, you know, and that now take me back to the issue of Mazen Namdekan, who also is asking for the self determination of the people of Biafra. Is there anything you can you know explain a little bit in regards to legal terms and? Uh, what have you in regards to that uh, two scenarios? Because Mazen Namdekanu is now being um, 
apprehended and he is under incarceration and they are putting charges on him. But the president of the country went as far as United Nations to converse for another nation to also have give it of, uh, for, for the people to have their own self-determination. So as a legal luminary, I want you to, you know, give us a little bit hint in regards to that. It's disturbing me. I'm sorry for us to ask you this question, but I have concern about it. It's allowed. The, the, the point is that uh, if you are following my if you are following my updates in this regard, also, and other lawyers who are also in the matter, it, we, have, we have variously said it uh, just we we we're just trying to reenact what the law says. That right of self determination is sacrosanct and inalienable. It's a right which has been domesticated into our law, and has become part of Nigerian law today. Uh, so uh, that brings to mind. I, I've said this in several forums that since members of IPOB has been taken to court in their numbers, hundreds. Can you tell me any of them that have been convicted in exercise of this right? The answer is no. Mm. Because once we get to the court, the court understands the position of the, the position as regards to the right to self-determination. So, and we have succeeded in getting them out from court. And, and most times, with um, punitive damages, costs being awarded against the federal government, we have a plethora of costs awarded against them today. So, which is still hanging on their neck in the by various, by various courts. So, what uh, what President Mohamed Bugari said is, in fact, doing our case for us because uh, it will be a reference point in the course of the proceedings, which I may not wish to go for. Yes, we have all the we have all the clips, and also we have assembled them. So we are going to use it in the fullness of time because it's also helping us in our case. So thank you yes. so much. Yes, uh, Barista, thank you. And uh, before you go, please, I would like you to uh, tell us if there's any message from our leader whom we all are looking up. Is there any message he sent you, maybe something he tell you to tell Biafrans, please, in regards to those who are dying and thinking about him? What is the people advice coming from him? People should stop dying. People should stop dying. He sends across the people a message of hope. Remain resolute and not shaking your resolve. And also prayerful in time like this. What is needed now is prayers for him. He's passing a trying period, which must come to an end one day. And I, I, I assured you that it will help end the praises. Uh, so sure. if you have opportunity of seeing him, you know that Nam Dekan is very firm and high in spirit. So I want people, I want his followers and also his supporters to emulate him. His strong spirit, he shouldn't despair, he shouldn't lose hope. Shouldn't be shaking and pray for him more importantly. That's the most important thing. Pray for him. He needs to be, he needs to, he needs to be prayed for. He needs to uh, God needs to protect him and God needs to guide him. We need to pray for his protection, for, for God to always be with him. And uh, because now he's he communes with God almost on every hour of the day. He's now praying morning after night. Let me let me let me shock you now. Let me shock you now. I, I, I have to say this to you, and it's for you to learn. Do you know, in the course of my discussion about what our legal strategies in court, in, in, in court do you know before I will say a word, our client, Mazin Namikan, will say, Joffa, hold on, let me say something. I had this message in, in the night. I will say this to you. And exactly what you will tell me is what I have in mind. Exactly what you tell me. Is what I wow. have in mind. That will tell you that he has gone far. So wow. he's doing well, he's doing well, he's praying, and their God is answering our prayers and he's committing everybody in prayer. So we need to pray for him too. And also pray for us because uh, we are the battle, we're in the battle front. So a lot okay. are going on now. A lot are going on now. People are being hunted, people are being chased for, people are being uh wale. people are being ambushed. So let the eyes of the enemies never see us. So, and they will believe that God will continue to guide us to who are at the forefront. And uh, there's no weapon of the enemy shall see light of the day of our life because we are there to do justice. We are there to set our people free. We are there to ensure that he's granted freedom. That's all because he has committed no offense unto the law. And so I'll encourage you to be resolute, to be unshaken and prayerful 
in times like this. Thank you and God bless you. Thank you very much, Barista Ifanye Jofo. You are one of us and you are the man that we are looking up to make sure that our leader is, is, uh, is um, you know, released soon. Uh, be before you say your, your closing remark, Barista, um, I want to ask this, just a very short question. Only one line can help me. What is the, um, the people who are being wallet, the people who are being hunted, the people who are being kidnapped, all these things that the, the government of the state is doing to us. If at the end of the day we finish and win this case, which I know we are going to win, what is going to be the punishment going to the, uh, the state of Nigeria that they have committed against their friends? In, you know, in, all the matter, all, in all our applications before the courts, particularly in regards to people who were arrested, are being incarcerated as president, because a lot of people have been, have been, have been detained in various detention facilities of the state security, both the police, the SSS, and the soldiers. So they have arrested our people in their numbers, in the thousands, and in the tenth day. So, and we are vigorously pursuing their freedoms in court. So, and uh, part of our relief, fundamental reliefs in all the places we are filing in court is for punitive damages, what we call a compensatory damages. So you have to pay compensation to them on account of that detention. So, and I, that's, I don't think I have done any matter uh, affecting uh, members of IPOB that were illegal to them and called them out of damages. So I, 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 some, a judgment was just delivered last week in, by Omar, here, Omar High Court, court number two. I may not mention the person's name. And the court, the court number two, I ordered the damages of $5 million against the police for illegal detention and torture of the person involved. So, and that's the position. I'll make it public in the course of time. I don't want to make it public for reasons that's not to me now. So we have always make sure that damages follow the uh, the acts of torture they are being subjected to. So, and let me say this to you. That's the only sacrifice you pay for agitating for right. But it will come to end, to end one day. So I, I usually advise to skill violence. Because once we go to court, we win. win. That's all that about it. Win. Right? Win. So uh, once you are operating within the confines of law, and we should have remained law abiding in all your activities. I've been maintaining that. I've been saying that. IP members have been law abiding in all your activities. So we'll go to court and argue it out. God has given us the wisdom. And God will continue to promote us and grant us more wisdom to defend them. So I uh, I don't think there's any IPOB of a family member that will be convicted for uh, for extra for merit for exercising his merit as prevailed on the constitution. I don't think it can happen. It cannot happen under the face of this. Uh, this I don't think any there's no court that, any court that will do that. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you very much. Please give us your closing remark because I know that your your time is already ringing. Thank you so much. Um, I just I has uh, just said. What we want now is prayers. Uh, and I want us to reduce this number of dreamers you are having in their platforms, in Facebook and everywhere. I'm beginning <laughs> to appreciate that people who have a lot of dreamers now and prophets and prophetess who are giving prophets. <laughs> so I'm doing you're it, dreamers giving us concern. You're giving us concern. <laughs> and because it's causing problem. Somebody mm -hmm. will sleep and wake up and start sending something on various platforms. And people will be calling me on phone. It's Honestly. giving me concerns. I sleep. I don't know whether maybe after taking some drinks, you go back to go to bed and then start dreaming about where and on the card is being tortured. I tell you, as <laughs> it is like holding this woman, and it become an issue to us. So confide those times, the time you use in that dreaming and professor prophet sign, right? Uh, yeah. time you use in making uh, dreaming and uh, dream something good. Uh, so to for prayers, it's more important. Yes. And, and the stop giving us sending those things to us that uh, is about to be uh, somebody said he will be killed this night or he has been tortured, he's dying, he's crying. <laughs> those things are distracting, us, distracting people. So yes. that's part of the things I want to add to what I said. So it will help us most. So those people who are doing it too, this is from doing it. It's a distraction. I call yes. it a distraction, but it doesn't work for me. And so mm -hmm. if you have a prophecy, pray over it. That let's convert it to a good prophecy. Don't it shouldn't mm -hmm. be negative. Of and you have a, if you dream, if you have a dream, convert that dream to a good dream, so to positive dreams, right? Yes. Thank you so much. Yes. So convert this to them. Thank you so much. I appreciate. 
appreciate you all for giving me the opportunity to to pass, to, to, to to be part of the fast form. So and I I will continue to participate in this program from time to time to update you on what is playing out and also be also circumspect of fake news. Fake news all over the places now. Uh, you have yes. to. Uh, I, I have to. You have to take the pains of writing this morning because. I got worried when I, I had about before my my meeting with him yesterday. It's, it was all over the places that Britain has gone to. In fact, as a matter of fact, somebody called me from US. <laughs> that was two days ago to interview me on that on that aspect. He said oh I want to God. find out the outcome of the visit of the of the United the, um, of the of United the Commission to Nigeria, the outcome mm -hmm, they have mm -hmm. visit, what they've mm -hmm. done, whether they've uh, whether they've taken him back to UK, and I became embarrassed. So, and mm. as a matter of fact, these people have not even set their eyes on him as a mm -hmm. mm -hmm. So, so these are things we have to be conscious of. So, whenever we are we are, we are working with information, let us verify it. If possible, call, go to my page, look at those things, make calls because I don't believe in fake news. Uh, so, because if you are saying that they visited him, you are inadvertently or inadvertently giving them credit, which they didn't deserve. Thank they deserve you. That credit you are giving them. So, thank so, you. My conscious yeah. of things we say this will mm -hmm. right. So mm -hmm. one obligation which should have been now compared under the law in Britain to, to assert that obligation. Because they must have to come and assert the obligations to restore the status of their natural who was kidnapped in Kenya. They have to do that. It's a, it's a, it's a, it's a compelling, it's compelling on the part to do that. So so telling saying telling being being um being being uh, being celebrated over the social media that we stayed in is part of giving the credit, so it should stop. So let us verify whatever we are doing, whatever we are saying, writing on our platforms. Thank you. Going Marissa, is there, Marissa, is, there, is there any how Britain can visit him without your consent, being his legal uh, uh, um, uh, the, the leader of, 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 of the of the view of the, fact, view of the fact that he is British citizen. Now remember, the, let me let me clear this part. The, the call that Mazen Nam the can renounce his Nigerian citizenship long before now. Okay. And, okay. And his Nigerian passport has been with the Nigerian government since then. Okay. So it has nothing to do with the Nigerian passport also ever since for the past five years. So now he has world only one national, which is British citizen. So so, she, so now. They are under compelling obligation to even make establish contact with federal government and also to detention facility authority to see him, and they will not say no to them. But because they know what mm -hmm, they are doing, mm -hmm. they understand the game they are playing, and that's why I cannot stop accusing them until this is done. Mm -hmm. They know what they are doing. They cannot mm -hmm. see him, so we should stop giving them credit which they don't deserve. We should stop yes. celebrating them. So thank you so much. I believe I've made a made some point. Beautiful. Thank you so much. Thank, Thank you. Thank, Thank you. So bless you. I appreciate that. Thank you. Bless you too. Bless you too. Thank you very, very much. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. God bless you. Thank you. Wow. Wow. That is Barrister Ifani Ejo for the lead counsel to Mazen Namdekano. You just heard him from the horse's mouth. You heard everything he said. Some people we are saying, stop asking him question. You are pushing him. Barrister is a learned man. Barrister is a learned man. And you can ask any barrister or any just any attorney, you can ask them any question. They will exhibit the level of their intellect. intellect. They will show it to you. And when I'm asking him this question that some of you are saying, stop asking him. So did you hear him say anything that is contrary to what he was supposed to say? No, is the answer. My number is open this evening. And those of you that want to contribute to this program, please, the number to call is already on the screen. Plus 491-521-4292-638. Call, and I'm going to answer your call. You have something to say in regards to all the things that Barista have said. I don't want somebody to call on this platform this evening to begin to talk about what happened in the year 1725. I will not entertain it. I can only entertain a call or a comment, a comment in regards to what Barista have just said now. Those of you that are saying, don't, don't ask him questions, don't ask him questions, you people should relax because when you want to travel, travel. When you want to travel, follow somebody that knows road so that you'll not be deceived. You have heard it from him that you guys should stop listening to rumors. Anything you do not hear from him is fake. 
all this information, all this fake information that is coming from left, right, right and center, uh, Maria Parasite, or area, they will continue to dream and talk rubbish. The Britain have come, they have taken him back to UK. Stop selling all those lies. And I want to use this opportunity to warn all these YouTubers. All these YouTubers with fake news that we say Mazen Nandekan was sick, they beat him, they break his leg, they do just to just to attract people, just to attract fellowship or listenership. Because you want to make money with the name Mazen Nandekan, you begin to lie. You guys are supposed to take care of yourself. Be careful and be careful about what you say about that man because he is an ordained child of God. You don't speak any ill of him. That is why I tell you guys that nobody, I repeat, nobody can kill him. And he is strong in the spirit and in the physical. You have heard from our barrister. He has told us that Mazen Nandekan is okay. And we are having the first caller on the line this evening. We have a first caller on the line this evening. Welcome to this program, Aside Hot. You are the first caller. Aside Hot, good evening. No, that is not the way to salute us here. Don't say as the hot. Good evening. You should say as the hot. Now, so you go talk him. Your number is your your line is not stable. Your network is not stable. Please, can you call us back? And when you call us, you tell us as the hot. Now, so we go talk him on this platform. We are on so many platforms, streaming live and direct. And the Marzi, if I knew a job for our lawyer, just fi uh, finished talking to Biafrance. And you listen to him, he said he's, he's going to keep updating people through this platform. He's going to keep talking to Bia France through this, this platform. And he warned all the drone are cananti. You will wake up and uh, you sleep and wake up and you begin to blow lies. You begin to say this, this, this. What, what you are saying, who is giving you that information? Number one, you are not his lawyer. Number two, you are not a DSS. Number three, you are not there. So everything you are saying is not true. So it's better you people keep quiet. Welcome to this program, Asi Dehot. Good evening. As in the hot NASA, I will talk and bro. Thank you very much, my brother. Your name and where you're calling from? Mazi Chukun, a native of Oka province, Biafra. I'm calling from Italy. Mazi, please go ahead and make your contribution. Few time ago, few minutes ago, our barista think uh, let's say uh, one hour or two hours ago, you post something about uh, social media designing and uh, and uh, some other things stuff on this uh, verified uh, wall page, let's say page. Then uh, some people were saying uh, maybe if not Paris, or maybe somebody hacked the account. And uh, as if you remember, would have uh, see allow him to speak on that because I believe that is him because uh, he's not you know Paris there, no? He might he may have other business that uh, he's doing that uh, would be giving him. Uh, some money also outside the, the issue of uh, his uh, profession. Then, uh, apart from that, I want to also say thank you to him because uh, his update is very important to our people. I believe uh, some people will also sleep well, but I know that our leader, the only thing I will be telling our, our people at POP is that uh, somebody from DSS, uh, DOS, from our our office, our side said that one of the things that we determine the well-being of our leader is our togetherness, our you know firmness. If we stand strong and the no division, no scattering, no problem, there is no way anybody in DSS or in the Zoo government or any government can harm our, our leader. But anytime we 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 have problem or scatter ourselves or begin to fight each other, then. That is the time they can do anything and go through because now they are afraid of IPO. They know that if anything happens, IPO is capable to do more than they even think. So they cannot touch him. That's Let correct. that thing be the priority of our people. Be together with your mind. Be strong. And that togetherness is encouraged to continue to stand for us there, wherever it is. And God will keep to keep him on, on the his, uh, release on condition. Thank you. Thank you very, very much, my brother. Thank you for your contribution. Very, very swift. I like it when people make this kind of contribution. Very swift. Go straight to the point. Say it the way it is. Then you leave the platform for others to call, to call and make their own contribution too. The line is open and we are discussing this evening. Barry Stephen, Joffa just finished talking to us. Let me answer the another call. Second caller, welcome to the program. Who is this one, Juan?
Can you imagine? We can't. We can't. Don't name a beer parlor. Now, now, town, Kobe, now, at this hour, now, why in the phone? Can you imagine that rubbish? Oh, people, why? Welcome to the program. I see the hot. The hot. Asa, Osaka. Thank you. Your name, even my brother. Your name and where you're calling from, please. Uh, Diko. Yeah, Diko. Uh, I would like to speak in Igbo. Yeah, I think I prefer to speak in Igbo. Go ahead. Uh, Diko. In actually, Iku. Me here now. No where a bag and so many here we go. I go bag and so many here we go. I will take another step. Another step to get the credit the just lost. Because can she appear now? I I was wondering if the only solution we have to take that the Gabu a solution I get me if I get me now that asking to what do you do? Because had already to give us this what we want. Open on the way, the zoo will work. Pocket on one on me. Maybe a high game, our chemistry people. So, solution, I will do that. I make you put in one Hold on, hold on. Hello, 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 hello. Can you hear me? Can you hear me? Yes, yes, I can hear you. Are you a member of IPOB? Yes. Where? Where? Which country? I am calling for United Arab Emirates. Are you a member of you of you of uh, um, IPOB in United Arab Emirates? That's say the truth. Yes or no? I have yes. no reason why yes, that's called. You are. Yes. Okay. This kind of things you are talking about now on this live live program is something you can take to your family meeting. That is, if you are attending to IPOB meetings, it's not something you can come and be saying it on a platform like this. Because you people are sometimes you will say, Don't say this, don't say this, don't say this, but you people go and say it. Because we find you life like this on this platform. Thank you very much for your for your call. So I don't want to entertain people who call and begin to say things. Welcome to this program, I see the heart. Thank you very much, my brother. Good evening, my dear brother. Good evening to you. Good evening, my dear brother. Good evening to you. Let my school come and bless you. You say, you say. So fine, English, yeah. English, I'm not talking with the broad language. Can you can speak? I want to use this opportunity. So I'm here for what? Why? My lovely brother. You can hear what our barrister said. He said that we let us stop writing nonsense. You see? Yes. So people can give British. I give British credit. Yes. But British never go at least our leader. It's a chance for him, somebody who does enter for media, social media, and start writing nonsense. Brother, hold on. Very, brother, hold on. Let me, brother, hold on. Let me tell you one thing. The people who are doing that are the are these uh, YouTubers. These guys who are doing okay. YouTube, they are the cost, they are the people who are causing this commotion here and there. Because they want to make money. Because they want to sell, because they want to attract a uh, uh, fellowship, they want to attract uh, uh, um, uh, what do you call it, um, uh, this thing to their to their site. They want to attract traffic on their site. They would put picture of Mazen Nam the Kanu, old picture of Mazen Nam the Kanu, when he, he was in Kujia, where he, he was carrying chain, uh, where he was carrying handcuffs. They would put it, concoct some. Brother, you are not in a conducive environment, please. Please, you are not in a conducive environment and the, the vehicles that are passing by are disturbing. So all you YouTubers should take your time and be careful because you are causing confusion here because you need people to listen to you. Uh, brother, please tell us I see the hot now so you go talk. I see the hot now so I go talk on my brother. Watching Thank you. Go ahead. Tell us your name and where you're calling from and make your contribution. Yeah, of course. Uh, my name is uh, David and uh, I'm calling from Italy. Mazi David, please go ahead and make a contribution immediately. Yeah, um, uh, first thing first, I want to thank you for your effort, and I want to thank the fans all over the world for their effort and for their push to make sure that our leader, Mwachineke, is released. Uh, it is not a, a kind of, a, it's not a surprise to some of us uh, I, in fact, uh, when the news first broke, some of us already know that Britain has hand in what happened to our leader. It is now becoming more clearer 
that they are the one that a kind of a, 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 a presided over everything that happened. And this is also one of those things that our leader always says. British, they don't want to let go. They don't want to let us go. But for some of us, there is nothing like letting us go. We are the one holding ourselves. This freedom, this Biafra that we are looking for, nobody will give it to us. The Son of Man have said it a thousand times. We will take this Biafra by force whenever we are ready. The whole world is against us, my people. And the Son of Man always said that Biafra will be welcome and it will be the last miracle on earth. We have to know that Biafra is not just a nation. Everything that the Son of Man, our leader, what Chileke have said, is nothing but the truth. Biafra is not just a nation, but Biafra is the kingdom of Chukukukika Biama on earth. And people ask, why do we have to fight? But the kingdom of God suffers and violence, and only the violence takes it by force. You know, so and now we are expecting the kingdom of God. I'm coming. I'm coming. So the kingdom of God will go to Mama Teha to give you food. Or you will go to Mama Teha to give you food. Please, be friends, uh, uh, please uh, pardon me for that. So uh, you, we are folding our hands and some of people are gossiping about and gossiping around and expecting the kingdom of God to just come down on earth. It is not going to happen. Everybody must get ready. I hear people gossiping just because one day in a week and I ask our people, are we really ready? Our leader has sacrificed everything. Every goddamn thing he has sacrificed it all. Just for me and you to live. Just for me and you to have a better life. He give everything. Give himself. And consistently saying if his life will bring about the Afra done, then who is he to hesitate? But here we are, some are gossiping. Here we are, some... Um, a please, kind of having fun. Please round up, my when brother. Round up. House is on fire. Round up so that I can take more calls, please. You know? Yes. Go ahead. Round up. Yeah. Please. So what I'm trying to say is that yeah, that is, what I'm trying to say in essence is that Biafrans must sit at home come on Monday. You must sit at home. And if it comes to the world that we have to increase it to two days, you still have to stay at home because this is the part of the sacrifice that all of us have to make. We are in our broad and we are doing in our best. We are putting everything we have to make sure we restore back our home. So I'm have to stop here, but be our friends at home. We must pay this last price. This is the last push. We must pay it. So, okay, be our friends. My brother, keep up the good work and be our friends all over the world. Stay focused because our leader will definitely rejoin us very soon. Thank you, Prince Valentin, for the work you're doing. Thank, Thank you. you. Thank you very much for your contribution, Mazi David. Thank you very, very much. We are here and we are soldiering on. I have another caller on the line. Welcome to this program, Mazi the host. Stop listening to your device. Stop listening to your device. When you call us, when we answer your call, you stop listening to your device and speak to us directly. Welcome to this program, Mazi the host. Thank you very much. Go ahead and make a contribution. Thank you very much, my brother. Thank you. Yes. All of Biafra. My brothers and sisters are great. Everybody. Your voice is not okay. Your voice is not okay. Your voice is not clear at all. Please do something about it. My my brothers and sisters yeah, it's okay, that are man. listening to me this evening, please. Listen very carefully. Huh? 
Listen very carefully because the land of Ndichie must be put in order. We owe nobody any apology for that. Hmm? Yes. I have been saying this for a long time. Hmm? That Britain, Britain can never put their embassy in their flat land. No. Nothing of no, Britain. No, Britain no, 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 no. No, you are out of the line. You are out of the line. You are out of the line. I don't entertain such broker and such comments on my on my platform. You are out of the line. We don't you don't tell your enemies, you don't talk to the people who are holding your freedom with such uh, uh, use such word for them. It's not acceptable here, please. If you call us and you don't know what to say, then it's better you listen to other people. Okay? When Biafra come, Britain are going to have their embassy in Biafra land. Yes. Even Hello. Nigeria. Good evening, sir. Good evening. Please hold on. I'm coming. Even Nigeria is okay. also going to have embassy in, in, in Biafra land. Even Saudi Arabia, all the Arabian countries that fought against Biafra, they all are going to have their embassy in, in Biafra. We are going to build bridges. We are not going to fight war with anybody. What we want is just to be free. Once we are free, then we will now set whatever uh, 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 the pace that we want them to follow. That is how it's done. You can't call on this platform and begin to say the British will not have embassy in Biafra land. I don't entertain such, please. Because Britain are going to have embassy here. Because if we go to Britain today, we have thousands and thousands of Biafrans who are holding British passport. There are thousands of them who are British citizens. So for you to say that their country where they nationalize will not have embassy, does that make sense? Sometimes we, our people doesn't understand how things work. I don't take such call, please. Welcome to this program, I see the help. My brother, go ahead and make a contribution. Yeah, good evening, sir. Good evening to you. Yeah, my, my, my name is Oki Jawan, calling from the Suebo State. Yeah, I want to use this opportunity to thank my ego barrister, barrister Jofo, and you in particular. But um, my brother, don't be angry with the... Uh, those people that are talking that kind of thing, because this kind of struggle we are, we are into now, nobody is happy anymore. Even me, I can't sleep. My mind can't rest because I, I'm, I'm still wondering how can the relationship be by force? And Britain is doing us bad. Let Britain allow us to go. Because Britain is the mastermind of all this problem currently happening in the Afghan land. So we are not happy at all. That's Thank correct. you. Thank you very much for your contribution, my brother. Please, if you call on this platform, I want you to learn how to talk. Somebody is holding your freedom. What you should do is to find a way to convince this person to allow you to go, that you're going to be in good time with them, not to tell them you are not going to do this, you are not going to do that with them. Knowing fully well that they are one holding you. You don't do that. Welcome to this program, I see the heart. At, at the heart, as I go talk him. Thank you. Your name and where you're calling from? Uh, my name is Maz Asondu, calling from land of Akesa. Beautiful. Go I ahead. greet all their friends. Thank you. My brother. There is noise. There is, there is back. There is background noise where you are. There, there is background noise where you are. Can you can you kindly move away from there, please? Yes. Okay, the okay, are you hearing me now? Yes, I'm hearing you before, but there was a background noise disturbing, and I don't entertain it. Go ahead. Okay, 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 okay. Okay, I uh, I thank you for the, this uh, this program you hosted today. You know, it's not easy for bringing by so your for your program to enlighten us and uh, keep us updated what is going on now with our leader Mazin and the Kano. You know, it's very nice. Thank you. No, it has given us more strength to move ahead. For those who are thinking that they are killing Mazin, they are doing anything to Mazin. Mazin, I want to let you people know that. Uh, Mazin Khan is even stronger than you people that are thinking about him. Our bodies are said what you need from you now is prayer, not gossip. Not gossip. What you need now is prayer. Please, all the Afghan, what you need is prayer, not gossip. Please, if you are, you are plus Martin and the Khan, please stop listening to gossip and focus. According to what Badalichi said, if you're anything that you don't hear from, from our bodies, it's not genuine information. Please, let us that be in our head. I don't know following with Shami the news. And again, on Monday, sit at home. You want your freedom, you want your freedom, you want our freedom. Please, on Monday, show that freedom that you want. If you want really freedom, as you're saying, that 
They are treating you bad in a country called Nigeria Zoo. Obey the law given to you by the IPOP leaders. Let the world know that whatever you are talking about is real. If you want that freedom, on Monday is an example, typical example for the world to know that what you're talking about is real. Let everyone sit at home, please. Let us do that. Thank you, my brother. Thank you. Oh, yeah, Biafra. Oh, yeah, Biafra. Thank you very much. Anna Zota channel, where's the wood? You can have bruises, or wood, Zota chute, where's the one? You, 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 you fight and get a crown before you, you fight for the mat. You are going to lay on the ground. Because if you first fight for the mat and get the mat, where are you going to put it? You are going to put it on the ground. This is an adage that is coming from our land, the Asian people. So there is how you address those who you want to get your freedom from. You negotiate with them. We cannot fight Britain. And we have thousands and thousands of our brothers and sisters who are British citizens. I see the heart now. We have thousands of them who are British citizens. Mazen Namdekani is also a British citizen. And Britain is, 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 is a civilized country. So you can't be saying that. I know it's one man opinion, so but I just have to I just have to do what I need to do. Welcome to this program, I see the heart. Yeah, I've answered your call. Please can you speak up? Hello, I see the heart, Nasa Gotakam. Thank you very much. Go ahead and make a contribution. I see the heart, Nasa Gotakam. Tell us your name and where you're calling from. Are you hearing me? The word is hearing you. Tell us my your name. name. My name. My name is Wonyo Chris Mowa. I'm calling for United Kingdom. Go ahead and make a contribution, my brother. Okay, sir. Well, um, I have to thank you first for inviting Mazi Ejofo for this program so that um, he can explain something about Mazi Lamdekal because I know that it's, it's him that can be able to say 100% anything about him. So what I want to contribute here is let people stop saying Mazi, Mazi Kano is dead or is going to be killed or is going to or something is going to happen to him. No, we shouldn't have that negative mind against him. Of course. So I, I thank God that uh, Barista, uh, Barista have said it. It's instead of we to have that such mind saying something against him that we should make it to positive, not negative. Okay, he asked us to pray, and we are praying. Many of us are praying. We are praying for for, the, for for him to leave. We are praying for him to be released. We are praying for him to come out. We are praying for freedom of Jaffa. But at the same time, we, are, we don't believe that God is working. We don't believe that it's God working. Some people are saying, oh, how can he be there? How can he be in the hand of DSF? And uh, and somebody is, and uh, but the boy is saying he's fine. He, imagine now the calorie is different from other individual or from any other person that can be there that DSS can be treated at anyhow is different it's a different human being so the way the DSS uh, is going to treat other people is not the same way they are going to treat him because they know who he is he's a lion so i'm here to encourage everybody to let us stop then he's going to be killed something is going to happen to him and we are just giving people more idea of maybe if, even if there's something they don't to do they will be thinking oh so these people are giving us ideas so let us turn this negative things into positive and pray and believe god where is our faith we are praying i put through to god god and bobla now for your mouth and i push it every time then that page of me i know that i push it so we don't have to go at it so about the garden of cool negative things about him yes so all him that he contributes all you are that i wish you forget about negative words we should have positive and continue to pray for him and believe that our prayer is being answered, which we know that our prayer answers. Our prayer, all the whole prayer, we are praying for the whole world. And don't let me hear you today. He's fine, he's okay. So let us believe him instead of asking him, Are you sure? Are you this? Are you this? No. So I don't care. Uh, can people push it in anything negative? We don't believe in negative. Our faith is that Mama Namdekali shall be free, and our faith is that Biafra is going to be free, and our faith is that all all IPOB everywhere they are in the whole world shall be free. So this is our our choice. Thank you. Thank you very much, sir, for your effort to bring him so that we can hear the truth I will keep from him instead of rumor. I, will... I, I hear somebody who, I, I think I, I was on social media, somebody wrote that uh, uh, the, the United Kingdom, the, the embassy, they went there 
and uh, and they promised and uh, and they were trying to uh, bribe him up, and he said no, I don't need uh, anything. What I need is Jaffa. All these rumors, my so brother. Tell rumors everywhere. Say something that he didn't say. Giving the 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 the, 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 the honor to to British embassy, Britain, which they didn't even go there. So what's the point of saying promoting yes, them why they have not been there? So let us learn to 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 verify things before we say it. This Thank is just my contribution. God bless you, sir. Bless you too. Thank you very much. Thank you very very much. I have said it before, and I'm going to say it again. All these YouTubers, those who are not going to YouTube, not going to internet, you people should be very, very careful. Because any lie you say against Mazen and the canal, once more from now, I will come after each and every one of you. Welcome to this program, I see the host. Hello. Welcome to the program, I see the host. Welcome. Good evening. Welcome. Your name and where you are calling from. Good evening. Welcome. Good evening. Welcome. Good evening. Where are you calling my name from? Is Hello, I am, my name is Everett. Hello, I am. Go ahead and make your contribution. Uh, my name is Everett. I come from Cross River State. Uh, what's now I want to talk, I just want to thank you for the way you talk, what you they do, and also thank our lawyer for what the work, the great work we they do. Yeah. So, the thing I get what I want to talk is. Uh, it's based on this hour, this is what will happen now. Let me hear me. My brother, keep talking. Hello? The world is listening to you. And huh? Okay. I don't like it when people are calling and they're listening to themselves. Welcome to this program, I see the heart. Hello? I have answered your call. Welcome to the program, I see the heart. I see the heart, I'm sorry, but okay. Thank you. Go ahead, your name and where you're calling from, please. If I, if I, in Indonesia, if I, please go ahead and make a contribution. Um, Okay. Um, young lady, who we can come there, we can make a. We can only be a coffee, a yogurt. We can only be a massage parlor. We can have a bamboo chair, we can you say what I know? About when I'm open, Manana got the card and money in Iron Wood if I need any help. Um, as a no other money, can we ask now? My hand is an honor, is sir. You're ready to reach our Yana and we know each other, is sir. Um, and a Manegum Bolam Bamakanam Bonawa money run out to you. And a Manegum Bonamakan, a Bonaquan, the one hour also. And make a number on the DOS for the visitors at all. I said, no, good in subscribe Yes. freedom of nothing else. I saw him Thank you. Thank you. Thank you very much for your contribution. Follow Huno Road, follow Huno Road, Solonia Moza, Moza. Welcome to the program, I see the host. You have seen how this man called me and is playing with his children. The other one called me where he was drinking beer and eating on Kobe. And there was so many noise there. I don't know why some people would be in a marketplace and they would be making, they would be calling or be in a very lousy area. It is not done because the world is watching. And this is Biafra Television. This is Aside Hot Biafra Television. This is Aside Hot Biafra Television on YouTube. This is Exodus Biafra Television. We are on eight multiple channels, simulcasting, live and direct. So you can come on this platform and you begin to, you know, you know, uh, uh, constitute, constitute nuisance. It's not done. We can't entertain you. Because this place is not a place where you come and play. 
This is a serious channel where we discuss about a nation and not just a nation, but that greatest nation on this planet Earth. Please, if I answer your call and I hear statistics on the background, you didn't change or go out from there, I will block you. Welcome to this program, Hello. Hello. Please, can you move away from where, where you are? There's noise there. There's background noise, please. No, I call him from uh, Democratic Republic of Congo. I know where you are. There's no, you are in a in, in a noisy place. Uh, listen, are you hearing me? I'm hearing you. I'm hearing you. I want you to go away from where you are. There is noise where you are. That is what I'm saying. We are hearing background noises where okay. you are. Okay, I've already move, move away. Go ahead, tell us your name. Uh, my and my brother, yeah, my name is uh, Efanye Ofordum. Go ahead. I'm calling from the, the Democratic Republic of Congo. Go ahead. Okay, my own contribution for the 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 agitation that uh, I'm playing, let the God Almighty uh, uh, see us through for this uh, struggle. I, I know one time ago that God reviewed me something, I saw Nigeria divide into three. Uh, uh, after that, I saw the message, hello. I don't want you to listen to yourself. The word is listening to you. If I can't hear you, I will tell you. Go ahead. Okay. Uh, God reviewed me as a, the way Nigeria divide into three. Because of that, before self, our leader, Mazin Nandekano, start to uh, this uh, strong group. Uh, because of that, if you, many people have to say something about that agitation, I told them that uh, God himself have already reviewed that Nigeria will be formed. So what I know that every hand holding Biafra land to no lies was withered by fire by Father this year. Yes, sir. I believe that God Almighty will see us through because yes, many things is happening in Nigeria, uh, especially for the leaders of uh, uh, this uh, uh, um, uh, Igbo politician. That are the people that made us to not get what we want. But God Almighty will come and see them through one day. Because when you come in the Yoruba land, we already see what is happening in Yoruba land. Ibohu, all the whole people in Yoruba land, they join Ibohu. Even that is, they are facing in Kotonu, they are moving to the Kotonu yes. and told the Kotonu people to leave her. But in Nigeria, even the kidnapper and the, all these bandits will do whatever they like in Nigeria. What then they will do or other people or Flani people then we call, call them and, and put them in the good place. Give them the, start to give them life, uh, tea, bread. But if I pop, stand in, in Biafra land to agitate, you will see they will come in the group and make sure they kill over 100 or 200 people. But what I know that one day God will visit all the whole saboteur in yes, Biafra sir. land. Whether yes, they sir. like it or not, it cannot say that Biafra cannot stand. Because God has already said about the Biafra. It's another country that God is led himself. And the grace of God is in that, in, in that country. So what, uh, what am I myself want to contribute in this matter? Whether they like it or not, Nandekano must come out with the Biafra. Yes, Even they go and meet Nandekano or not, what I know that Nandekano must come with the Biafra. That yes, is his own contribution. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you very, very much, my brother. Because Onya Ineso, Abogin Watakili, Onya Ineso, Bo Kenyama Alife, and Chukwo Kikabiyama have chosen him for this great movement. And he is in the, for, in the forefront fighting to restore our own nation. And I would like to I would like to play a jingle. Okay, let me answer this this call. Let me answer this call. Welcome to this program, I see the heart. I see the heart, Nasa, is the token. Thank you, my brother. Go ahead and make a contribution. 
My name is Song. I'm calling from United Kingdom. Your name is what? Um, first of all, Onwa, Onwa, I'm calling from United Kingdom. Okay, go ahead, Onwa. First of all, uh, I have to thank you, Onwa Chineke, for the great job you're doing. Thank it's you. not easy. If anybody thank you, it's easy. Let him come and try it a little. Thank you. And um, secondly, concerning our leader, the greatest of all, Ahmadike, <laughs> the one and the only. Um, the thing is that I won't tell because you, you know him very well. But for those people who doesn't know him, I will tell them, let nobody panic. All these things are for a reason, because if there's no test, there won't be testimony. It's all happening so that we will testify sooner than anybody expected. Some people think, oh, there, he will go there, DSS, I kill him. Oh, Hamadike is bigger than a nation. You can't kill him. He's, he's superhuman. If you don't know, I know him in England right before he got the call came to him. He didn't choose himself. Elohim chose him. He wanted to run away when the call came, but he was forced to do what he's doing. That's why he's not scared. And the millions of us are behind him. So I just want to give their friends all over the world courage that there is nothing, no, no, no cause for alarm. Hamadike is, 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 he, 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 he's safe. Just like uh, our barrister said. So let nobody panic. Let nobody worry. Thank you. And uh, to close my remark, uh, Darlington, thank you so much. Thank you. I can't thank you enough. Thank, thank, you. You. thank you. Thank you. Thank you. thank you. It's not everything I will say on air. But let me give other people a chance to talk. Thank you so much, Darlington. Thank you. God bless. Bye-bye. Bye. Bye you. Thank you very much, my brother. I have another caller. And Biafras, please do not forget that on Monday is lockdown. We are locking Biafra, Biafra land down on Monday. We are not opening our shops, no schools, no hospital. Every, only hospital can open. Every other place is going to be locked down. Every other place is going to lock down apart from hospital. Only hospital is allowed to operate on Monday. Every other offices, every other schools, what have you, is going to be locked down. Welcome to this Hello. program, Asi Hello. Hello. Hello, Asi. Good evening, sir. Welcome to the program. Your name and where you're calling from. Uh, my name is Igwe uh, Meka uh, Victor. I'm calling from United Arab Emirates. Okay. Go ahead. Uh, Mazi, uh, thank you very much, Mazi. I must thank you very much for your good work uh, towards our father lad. You are doing a great job to us uh, and honor our comrades. Your people are doing a great job to us. We commend your people to, uh, to continue in your good work. Uh, I'm, I'm assured very soon our nation will be restored because we have determined. Instead, our nation Biafra will not restore. Everything will go down. That is our motto. Okay. We are not joking with uh, Fulani Janjaweed. Um, I must thank our barrister Ejofo for uh, his good work and uh, his team. And I pray for him and uh, his team so that God will, uh, will give them wisdom to continue the, the good work. Uh, and I'm telling our Biafra brothers all over the world, let us stand firm and respect each other. Let us send an apology just as our brother from uh, South Africa um, Ikenga, Urago, just tender apology for his mistake. Let us learn how to tender apology to each other because that is what we, uh, we make us to, to have a very good country. Let us stop blaming each other. Let us respect uh, uh, each other. That is what will help us to build a very good nation. And I'm, I'm telling, I, I want to use this opportunity because I know that Full and Jaja, we are listening to this uh, program. I want to use the opportunity to tell them it's better that they respect themselves. Let us build, let us do this thing in a peaceful way. Let us let every nation go his, his own way. Let us do it, do it in a peaceful way so that we, we will be a good neighbor to each other. So that we will be a, be a good neighbor to each other because the Europeans are not doing any good to us. 
the Europeans hate we Africa. They just take us as a as a as a useless people. All slightly that we must understand this. Let us do this in a peaceful way so that we be a good neighbor. Because you see Biafra, we must restore our nation, Biafra. Come brain, come shine. I must thank everybody. Let us re remain resolute. Thank you very much, Mazi, for a good work. Thank good you. night from United Arab Emirates. Thank you very much, my brother. Respect is reciprocal. Respect is reciprocal. It is a give and take affair. You respect me, I respect you. You don't respect me, you don't expect any respect from me. But the issue we are talking about right now is about the leader of indigenous people of Biafra who is under incarceration in the DSS dungeon. Our barrister have come to give us this word. He have told us that <laughs> Mazen Nandekanu is very, very high in the spirit. And he's praying for each and every one of us. Yes. He is praying for each and every one of us. And we should, in return, pray for him too. That is what we should do. Yes. While he's praying for us, we should pray for him in return. And don't forget that Mazen Nandekan have also denied his Nigeria international passport, his citizenship, Nigeria citizenship, because we are forced to be citizens of Nigeria. We are we are not a homogeneous people of Nigeria. We are not homogeneous to Nigeria. Nigeria was created by a woman and a man. And that is the truth. And they know. And that is why it's not standing. And when I look at uh, what the idiot you called Ganduje said about uh, the people who are agitating for Biafra and Odudua, should shed their tears, uh, sorry, shed their sword uh, so that they can come together and discuss. Discuss on the on who, on what ground? On the blood of Ikonso that you killed, on the blood of Onyeze, on the blood of uh, of uh, Ugeze, on the blood of all the gallant men and women that we are massacred, that we are killed. Is what you want us to come back and negotiate with you. Chineke Bokwagina negotiation, Oku. The only negotiation we will talk about today is when you guys are giving us date for referendum. Yes, if you like, come to Biafra and turn my village to international airport. Turn everywhere. Build it to be like America. We are not interested. People have died for the Biafra we are fighting for. Therefore, there will be no negotiation for any kind. None whatsoever. Biafra, it's time you begin to follow a platform that tells you the truth. It's time you begin to follow a platform where you go and listen and you get something that is very, very important that is going to help you. Not a platform where it is only gossip, 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 gossip and gossip. And now, Basaga, somebody that doesn't have content. You don't have a content. You don't have something to talk about. You come and be gossiping. Say Mazen Nandekano was a... Uh, they have taken him to the United Kingdom. Uh, some people say they have killed him. Some people say they have done this. Some people, they have done that. This is arrant nonsense. This is arrant nonsense. Stop listening to the seducers. Ndiasere, Bakute, and causing harm to a, lot, a whole lot of people in Biafra land. Causing harm. You are causing a whole lot of harm to our people. Because so many people doesn't have the mind to, under, to, 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 to even endure. You come and you'll be lying to them, Mazen and Khan have been killed. I told you guys that on this platform, that Mazen and Khan is unkillable. They know if you kill them. No, they're not born the person. They know born the person where well, Rego say he won't kill Mazen and Khan. He won't kill who? In Abachi Gimba. If you try, you die. If you try Mazen and Khan when you won't pay, what should you say? If there's a scratch on Mazen Nandekano's body, I repeat, I'm saying it, I make haste to say it, I'm proud to say that. If there's a scratch on Mazen Nandekano's body, when the whole world will witness the Third World War, I swear to God, go to Britain and count how many thousands of Biafrans that are there. Go to America. Go to Germany. You think you can wage this kind of war? You can't. The only option you have is to let this man go and give us our freedom. I have another caller on the line. Caller, welcome to this program, as they hot. Hello, as they hot. Good evening, Lord. Don't say you should tell me as they hot. Now, so you go talk him. Nobody say you go call me as they hot. My name is Mazo Alezi Chukubi Kemi. 
so we we'll talk about can guy but is in the go ahead as in um that my brother man as so yeah to the coach you want me here the moya still have coach you want me for the job thank you thank you so the man a problem our people our people will know they want to so Many of us now put online. I am a refining. I don't know why the reason why many of our people we love so much long to see. We have to everybody, everybody, we will not go there. So, you know, but I'm telling you, sure of another person or something like that. I don't mind anybody, like, oh, uh, but in their list, you have therefore a bit of explanation about the uh, other kind we are franchising the main interview. What I go, we never check out the program. That's in. When 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 anybody is over, they are all those things because I know that now what is just discussing all those things, which is the 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 just now I will forget like you be dead. I will go and do a year now. You know how on the phone work. What I go, so forget about those people. What I go, I wanna I wanna follow now. What if any me? Like now, with that one, they bring the balance now. After what I go, now they bring the balance. I've been hearing people they are wanting money. After what I go, when 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 you buy the consolidated balance, when you make it, you know how the lawyer lawyer you enjoy more than the car. I don't like YouTube. You don't see. You can go back some of us. So you can see. I have one of my my friend DSS. Tell me you what. But I want to know. I called you on phone, and you would hear this. I'm not an American. No, no, no. I don't. I'm a natural. I'm a people who want to hear something from me. But who would my job? Who would not ask me come away? My brother, look at that. I don't want to see the guy getting him mad. Ah, oh yeah, but I'm not a poor man. I'm not like an Facebook man. I'm a poor man. Everybody is talking. Why? We're not a poor man. Can you quit? Can you quit? I want to so much. Not gossip. I don't know why. Even my no when you join here just not for saga with woman one yeah color sense or they come with smoke with smoke with an IPOD and we smoke with an IPOD they want to go us what you just working for a slave master which is I'm I'm no 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 here they can go but but down now what which is slave master no which one find the video video which is everybody know I don't know the reason why why people need it I resolve something very quick very quick. Thank you. There is how Thank I you. respond to such people. If you check every of my updates on every of my platform, when I'm saying something, I when I'm maybe here, I do difficult things. If I'm not doing that, maybe I'm here. I'm going to show you how to do it. I'm going to show you how to do it. I'm going to that talk, that particular issue that people are afraid of. People say, who is going to talk about this? Hey, I'm afraid. Oh, hey, I cannot say it. I don't want to make enemy. In as much as what I'm saying is truth, and I'm trying to save IPOB and Biafrans of something that is important. I don't care about who you are. I come out and I say it. Yes. If I start it, listen, Biafrans, you don't get money again, money. I know they fear nobody. I don't fear nobody. My father knows me for that. My mother knows me for that. My friends, they know that I'm a fearless son of the fearless father. I'm, I can only respect you. I will respect you, but I know they fear you. Somebody will come to cause a problem that is taking life of millions of people, and you say, I should keep quiet. I won't. And when I start it, there will be war. They will open war from all channels. Hey, 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 you are talking too much. You are spoiling things. You are causing problems in IPOB. You are doing this. You are doing that. I look at them. I laugh. You know why I laugh? I laugh because I know who they are. I know who they are. I know who they are. That is how they operate. But I don't care. And at the end of every but I don't care. And at the end of every exposition that i have done in this struggle i always win go and check the history i have never come and say anything that doesn't come to, to fruition because welcome to this program as the host hello yes hello yes hello hello good evening my brother good evening to you
Go ahead and make your contribution. Uh, good evening. I see the heart. I saw the talk of my brother. Thank you very much. Your name and where you're calling from? Yeah, on oh, no way. I'm calling from Germany. Please go ahead and make your contribution. My contribution is that I want to encourage the platform about this uh, law. I want to call it the, I want to call it the difference according to the uh, the seat at home on Monday. Go ahead. Mm -hmm. Okay, I encourage all the difference to stay at home. That we need to lock all their fire down. That if you if you see now, Nigerians are very wicked. The zoo, the Nigeria cause is very wicked. The death of the consul a morning shadow here, and they couldn't have many. I have a kidna power that our leader. So I back when I take care on him with it. So our people should stay at home. It's very important. So I am the young devil because I have tried one that you shake it. Thank you. Thank you very much for your contribution. Thank you very much for your contribution. Uh, dear friends, as you can see, we are moving speedily on this platform this evening. The evening of Friday, 6th of um, 6th of um, August, 2021. I hope I'm correct, because sometimes I get to, I used to get lost of time because of Ife Bonisi. The day that Paris Stefani Jofo have come once again, as usual, to speak to Biafrans and to give us updates in regards to what is happening. The man which we are seeing through his eyes, the one and the only great barrister. And I asked him a whole lot of questions here this evening. Those questions, I am glad he answered each and every one of them with great sense of reasoning and wisdom. And one of the things that he said that touched me so much is that whenever he want to talk, tell our leader about, maybe want to update him in regards to his, um, the torture, uh, in regards to uh, his uh, legal uh, movement and the, what have you, our leader will say, wait, he will tell him what he has seen and he's going to be matched. That is to tell you that the man is, is highly in the spirit. We are not following a fool. And that is why I am urging all Biafrans across, across this globe to block their ears from seducers, block your ears from those who are money mongers, those who are only looking for how to make money on, on YouTube, those YouTubers that we just put two pictures together and post and write one, one, uh, one catching article. When you look at it, you click to listen, then you begin to hear another nonsense. My 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 program is more or less a, 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 a reality program. Yes, because everything I'm telling you is what is happening. I don't come to tell you fiction. I don't fix things to tell you. I don't, you know, let me memorize things to tell you. No, it's either I'm telling you what has happened already or what is happening now. But they put themselves together they begin to they begin to they begin to play with people's mind they are playing with people's emotion because they are looking for money because they are looking for money i have a call on the line welcome to this program i see the heart welcome to the program i see the heart As is the heart, now so I go talk. My school became. Uh, thank you for this program you anchored today uh, with Barrister Stephanie uh, Jopo, uh, the legal counsel, the lead counsel to our uh, uh, Onyin Dumas in Nandi Kano. Uh, we know what he is going to do now. Uh, I thank you for bringing him on. Uh, you know to speak to Bia fans all over the world. Uh, you don't know what he have done to all Bia fans today. Uh, no matter what they are seeing uh, on the social media, the saga they are seeing on the social media, this, this program you anchor today has given hope to millions of Biafans because they are asking, where is our leader? This is the only man we can confine it that have seen our leader. 
This is the only man that has uh, okay. that has spoken to so our leader. And we thank him, Mazi Fanny. We can't thank him enough because, because he has lost uh, his dear ones. He so has he been born twice uh, during, during this project. And we know what he's going through. We know what he's going through. It's not easy. It's very painful. And he, and he consistently stayed on with us, with our own Hindu. Uh, I'm, I'm urging all the Afghans at, at this time of this struggle. What we need now is total support to the to the social media, the Biafra social media team. We want them to rise up. I've been in the United States for a very long time. I live in Atlanta, Georgia. Um, presently, if America goes to any war, they send their media out. They send CNN, Fox News, others, all the whole media will go into that nation, which they want to fight with. And they are the first, first foot soldiers that go there to find out what, what is about to happen. I uh, want our Biafran to support the, our, our social media any way we can, because without them, uh, like you now, without you, we will not be able to hear from our, uh, uh, our legal counsel, if I, if I is your fault, it is the power of the social media. We want uh, everybody who can support you to make sure you are, if it's two or three times in a day, you come on air, it's very, very important. We are going into war, the final battle. The final battle is about to happen. If we don't have the social media support, we are going to die. We know, we know we'll be in dark. We'll be living in dark. So please, anywhere we are, anywhere you are, both those at home, we know that we in the, in the diaspora are the ones making contributions for the ESN. But now, those at home, they are on ground. Like uh, Mazi Chukwebuka, uh, you are on ground. We need us to make sure anyway, anyway we will make our contribution towards ESN. We have to keep on paying that money until the other is restored. It's, it's, it's a non-stop payment, monthly dues, or uh, any donation you can go, give or support you can give. Please let us build our social media to the point that we will say yes. Uh, Biafra is, is strong. Uh, Biafra knows what we are doing. Thank you, Chuku, Chuku, Chuku became for what he have done today. <laughs> and you. I send my greetings to Ifani Jopo because you. he has revived the soul of most Biafans, yes. especially our young ladies, within the, the teenagers and those who are in their early 20s. He has given them hope. He has given them hope. He did, he did well. Thank you. Thank you very much, my brother. Thank you very, very much. You say we are entering into the last stage. We are already in the last stage. And the media is fighting in the front line. And that is why sometimes you see me, I come online, I appeal to Biafrans to please help us. Those of us that are broadcasting, that are on the ground, those of us that are, you know, tweeting, those of us that are, you know, extending this, this movement, this um, uh, broadcast, sharing all the people that are talking about Biafra. Thousands of them are out there on the ground. Sometimes I do call on them, those of our brothers and sisters in the diaspora, to support. Last time, people sent money. I bought a recharge card. I shared the recharge card for like two weeks. Those that knows me can, can bear me witness to this. I shared the recharge card for like two weeks. People were sending me money for my brother. I was buying the recharge card. I was sharing to people. And it helped a lot because so many people use it to do a whole lot of work. So on this social, on this, uh, social media, that we are, we have occupied social media as a matter of fact. We are in charge. We are in charge. Nigeria cannot match us in social media war. They know fit. CNN cannot. BBC cannot. Do you know why? Because Mazinan can have prepared our mind. Every Biafran is a journalist. Every Biafran is a reporter. Every Biafran is conscious of what is happening to him and to his brothers and his sisters. So because of that, we have taken over the media. That is why anybody that speaks against Mazenan Dekano, if IPOB descend on him or her, that person is gone. Go and ask Kemi Olu lawyer. Ask Kemi Olu lawyer. When she spoke against Mazenan Dekano, Biafra descended on her until she ran out of, out, out, of, out of Facebook. She ran away. She ran away. She disappeared. She brought her page down because of Mazen and the canoe. She talked nonsense. Biafrans went after her. I have another caller on the line. Caller, welcome to this program. I said, the host. Stop listening to your device and talk to Biafrans, please. 
I will cut you off if you are still listening to the pro. Oh my goodness me. Now that I have cut it up now, you will not be hearing my voice. When you call, I answer your call. You switch off. Immediately you notice that I answer your call. It's either you lower the volume of that set you are listening or you move away from there. That is how it is done. You can't be listening to the radio and listening to me at the same time. The two speed is not the same. So, Baris, if I have come to give uh, to give us hope once again and to explain to us exactly the status, how Mazen Namdekan is faring and what is happening. And he, he gave us updates in regards to the court case, the court, court proceedings. And there is a hope that during this holiday, during this vacation, that Mazen Namdekan may be brought to court. There's a hope. From what he explained here this evening, because he has filed for Mazen Nam the Kanu case to be heard during this holiday. And once it is done, once it is granted, I'm going to bring him here again to speak to Biafrans. Uh, I think there are some people that are inboxing me that they want to join me on this platform. Um, I, I'm going to uh, use the remaining minutes, you know, to see if they are ready. I have only about 20 minutes. Uh, let me post it here for those of them that want to join me live on this program as it is hot you can click and join me from anywhere you are that is the link once you click on it you sign in you can join me live as it is hot welcome to the program as it is hot hello welcome to this program as it is hot your name and where you're calling from i'm calling from india your name please is Chisapa calling from India. Go ahead and make your contribution. Make your contribution, please. Uh, uh, my contribution, uh, brother, I want to thank you for your good work you are doing. I'm be following your program all these days. Thank you. And I'm happy for the to bring in our lawyer uh, in this uh, program today to make some people to Some people that is, is, is still uh, good or okay and okay for where it is today. Another thing I want to contribute in this uh, program today is based on our, our total lockdown on Monday. I want to encourage every one of our brothers and sisters outside. I believe we all have brothers in in our land, Biafra. We, we are the one who have to tell them, encourage them to be a seat at home. I believe whenever you talk to your brother or your sister in the Biafra land, most of them will be listed because this program you are doing here and now, most of them don't, don't reach into reach because of data or light happening in that land. So we that living in outside here have to encourage them, give them the experience and what they, what is going on so that they will listen and give that to obey and sit at home and that on Monday. By the grace of God, she will guide them and will lead us and see us through at the end of this short struggle in Jesus' name. You yes, sir. You yes, sir. He said, thank you very much, my brother. Thank you very much for your contribution. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you for, your, uh, for your, your contribution. We are still here, and Biafra shall come in our own lifetime. Biafra, and those that have given their life because of this struggle, we remember them and pray that their spirit should continue fighting until Biafra is restored. Their spirit should, be, should continue fighting from the spiritual realm, why we are fighting in the open, in the physical realm. At the end of the day, they died because of Biafra, and Biafra must be restored in our own lifetime. If you are just joining us this evening on this platform, I see the heart. I say, welcome to the program. I remain your brother, Mazi, Obaleze, Chukubi, Kem, Ago Biafra, Kem, Bonam, Bonana Biafra. Ago Biafra, I call them, oh, we move further, some people will be angry. <laughs> I think somebody wants to join me on a visual. I don't know. I need to see this person. Please, if you're joining me, make sure you don't put on singlet. If you're joining me, make sure you stay where, 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 where is, uh, is brightened up, at least I will be seeing your face. It is very, very important to do all that because I can't be talking to you when you are seeing me and you are there and I'm not seeing you. It doesn't make sense. It doesn't make sense at all. So please, if you are joining me, make sure that you are in a very good position. I don't want those that we are single or those that come half naked. I will not entertain it, please, because the world is watching. 
we are IPOB, we are indigenous people of Biafra. We do things our own way and we do it perfectly. Thank you very, very much. Somebody is about to join me, but I have not seen this person. I must have to see you. If I don't see you, I'm not gonna bring you, I'm not gonna bring you to the studio. They're going to be behind the studio until I see you. <laughs> Namdekano, Namdekano, ah madike. Kani kene benu kano. Namdekano, Namdekano, ah madike. Ah madike biafra. Namdekano, Namdekano, ah madike. Ika kugundi lo yo. Yes, so and I'm having somebody that is joining me on this platform. Uh, his name is Cletus Henry. Cletus Henry, what is happening? This place you are you are is very, very dark. Please, you are in a very dark place. I can't entertain this. Please, I'm sorry. If you are not in a bright place where I can see you, you will see me. I can't entertain touch light. I know you must you may be in, 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 in Nigeria where there's no light. Then if you want to say something, please go ahead and call us on our on our land on our um, on our studio line is going to be better so far you are not uh you are not visible i cannot see you please i cannot see you so far i cannot see you then you can call on voice then the world may hear will hear from you so i can't welcome you to this platform without seeing your face because the world is watching i have another caller on the line let me answer this caller Carla, welcome to this program. I see the hall. Don't call on video. Don't call on video. Don't call on video. Call only on, oh my goodness me, my people. Hi. <sighs> to do this thing is not easy, honestly. It's not easy. You will meet different character, different attitude. Some of them will provoke you. I am on live video, and you are calling the platform, and you are calling on video again, that I may be on two different videos at the same time. Does it make sense to you? It doesn't make sense. If you want to see me, you are seeing me already. So why calling me on 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 you on a, on a WhatsApp on video again? You call on 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 ordinary uh, call, WhatsApp call. We talk, and while we are talking, people the world we hear your voice. And those that want to come on live video or uh, on visual that want to appear on the studio, then you stay where there's where where we have light. Okay, you have to stay in a in a, in a bright uh, uh, location so that. At least I will see you. The world will see you. You will not be in the dark and you are calling somebody. What am I going to see? I have another caller on the line. Caller, welcome to this program. I see the heart. Yeah. Good evening, my dear brother. Good evening to you. Happy the heart. That's how I talk. My name is Austin. Thank I'm you. I'm from uh, Idu. Idu, go to me, go to Jaffa Land. That's As correct. Best, my name is Austin. Yeah. Go ahead. Uh, I didn't know that uh, you, you'll be online this evening. I'm just on school. We am from uh, work now. Okay. You know, I called you before that, you know. Yes. Uh, what I want to say, you know, I just call our people at home. They are not, they, many of them, they didn't understand the places that should lock down. I think you have to mention it. It do be a firm and all this. It don't make, if you can help, help us to mention it for them here. You understand? So that many of them will hear. Then those that are told that hear it, they will. What you know, they, are, they are not aware. Of it. Not everybody is aware. Because I call. You know, that's only what I want to tell you. Please. Please. You say I should make it that should lock down. That's good. Okay. Yeah. Okay. That's on the night. You understand that? Okay. Okay. I hope Thank you understand. I understand. Thank you very much. Thank hey, you. Help us. Help Thank us to stay so that they will understand. That means I mean the, the places that they should start to the web Biafra, that's Biafra land, yes. Only that. Thank you. Yeah, yeah, only that. Yes, um, this request from this, my brother, is a very good one because some of our people do not know the boundaries of Biafra. Boundaries of Biafra started from the mountains of Cameroon. The people you know as uh, Bakasi Peninsula, that land belongs to Biafras. If in case you don't know up to the place we know as Edo State today. Up to the place we know as Edo State, the land of Igodomi Ikodo, the Idu land. All the people, for as long as Igodomi Ikodo land is concerned, Edo State general, we are Biafrans. 
Delta State, Edo State, Bayasa State, Cross River State, Akwaibom State, River State, Enugu State, Ebony State, Abia State, Imo State, Anambra State. And uh, Lower Benue and Lower Kogi, these are places that are known as Biafra Land. Welcome to this program, I see the heart. Yeah, good evening. Good evening to you. Hello? Good evening to you. Yeah, I'm calling from... Good evening. I'm calling from Nigeria. Okay, your name, please. I want to, like, suggest something, like, Ohaneze and, and the rest of um, the, their group, they are not helping matters, and they are really help thanking the military for coming to kill Biafrans. I don't know what we need to, as in, we need to do something about it. Because having these people doing all this, their families are not here. And they're killing other people's children or other people's family. If we can kill us all, we need to do something about it. Because this is getting out of hand, please. It's too much. Thank you. Thank you very, very much, my dear sister, for your contribution. Our Hanes and Dibo, we know them. They are errand, they are errand men. I don't want to call them boys before I send them now. <laughs> they are errand fathers. <laughs> they are errand fathers to Fulani. Yes, that is why you saw a king that I showed once upon a time kneeling down before a before a ginger with a, 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 a emir. He was kneeling down. Only God knows what he was begging him. Only God in heaven knows what he was begging him. Maybe he was begging for contract, Abuja. Oh, Haneze, you people should know that Ohaneze is not relevant anymore. That is why the, the, the Nigerian government cannot negotiate anything in the eastern region with them. Once they call them to Abuja, they come to Abuja, you will see where, they, where, they, where, they, where the, the emirs of the, of the north and the kings of the east gather. The kings of east will sit down on the floor, then the emirs will sit on the chair. That is to tell you, these are the masters and these are the slaves. And we, the children, we refuse to bow down for them. And that is the problem we are having today. Because of Fifa Hageli, because of what they are going to eat. They are shooting your children, killing your children. You are not saying anything. And after you come out and say that you are Haneze, after you say you are from Aki Kenga, you are from Muzurume, and your people are being massacred, and you are not saying anything, your children are being killed, your wives are being raped, you are not saying anything. Anyways, it seems like they are getting up, small, small. Because last time I saw... Um, Barista Godi Wazurike, who came to represent Ohaneze because he is the uh, attorney. Um, he is the, uh, the Ohaneze Nibu, uh, uh, worldwide lawyer, their representative. Okay? So he came to the court last time that our leader Mazenandikan was supposed to appear. Because I don't lie. If they do the one that is good, I will say it. If they do the one that is bad, I will just say it. Here on this platform, I see the heart. That day, I saw God was Rike, and they sent um, uh, a former governor of Anambra State, Okwadiki Ibuku, Chukwemeke Zife, to come and they also represent them. And then Zife came. They interviewed him. He said, I, I came because of, because of my son. They are holding my son. That is what should be done. And I did not expect only Okwadike to appear in that court that very day. I expected all the whole king. Biafras, do you know that if all the Ohanese Ndibu, all the people that call themselves Ohanese Ndibu, all the Ndiche, all the Ndobi, all the Ndes, all the Ndos, march into Abuja? Oh my goodness me. If all of the Nyobine Brokun Kararia, Oyobine Brokwe, Obwezia, Oyobine Kege Jidoji, Jidoji, all of them are march. Yeah, come, but I may appear. I swear to my Heavenly Father, before 72 hours, these people will run around and bring Mazen and come out. I'm telling you that. And I'm beating my chest to tell you. If our so-called Ohaneze, our kings, if they all of them march out with their, with their wives, they, they, if they invent the, 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 the premises of uh, uh, Nigeria uh, High Court and say, we need our son, we have come to carry our son, you are holding our son, believe you me, believe you me, but they sent few representatives so we are watching them on that foot that they have bring out. They brought one kind of you know step out and they are watching those their steps until they go the other way around. I appear here. So no sensible man or father 
should keep quiet when his own children are being massacred. Nobody that have common sense can do that. If you do that, you are not a good father. Because even if you go to catch a, a chicken, the mother will come after you and fight you. If you want to go and catch a bird, a small bird on the tree, the, uh, the, the mother of that bird will come to fight you. Go and catch small puppy now, the mother will come and fight you. This is animals. And if animals can protect their own children, how much more the so-called Ohanes and Lotion and Dharma? They cannot protect their own children because they have sold the future of their children. Because of a because because of a pot of a, a pot of, of rice, let me answer this caller because I'll be bringing this program to an end very soon. Welcome to this program, Asi Dehot. Uh, Asi Dehot, Nasai Betakam. Welcome, my brother. You have two minutes, please. Round up. Go ahead. Good uh, evening. My name is Mazi Okudere. I'm calling from my location. Go ahead and make your contribution. Asi de, Asi de, I, I just want to collect something. Is is the full and is our problem, not our sir. Funali Danja weed because I had you say that Osana, it may be a mistake. So I just want to correct you. And another thing I want to say, please, as the host, to remind our people to go back to Twitter. So tweet to tweet the US government, to tweet the um, 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 Germany government, you know, to go back to our Twitter, to leave Facebook because Facebook is for gossiping. So I want to remind you to tell our people to go back to Twitter. Thank you for giving me the opportunity. May you go cover bless you and bless our beloved leader. Bless the head of DOS, Mars Ticket, bless all IPOV family member worldwide. He said, thank, he you. Say, he thank say. you. He said, thank you for calling my attention on that. It might be a slip of tongue because you know, sometimes when you are very, very upset on issues that is bothering you, you tend to make mistakes. So uh, we know. That for a very long time we've been calling all of them until now that they have made themselves they have separated themselves declared themselves they are fulani and the houses so it is the fulani that is our problem houses are good very nice people my father testified to that because my father lived in sabon garikano for, for some years and he confirmed that he can trust an Hausa man but you cannot trust a fulani man because fulanis their own is to conquest their own is to conquer everybody. That is their own. But you can entrust whatever you have in the hand of an Hausa man. Come, rain consortia, and when you come back, he will give it to you. They are nice people. And that is why Mazen Khan is fighting for us, fighting for Duduwa people, fighting for the Middle Belt, fighting for the common Hausa people, fighting for, apart from Fulani who have come to kill and destroy people's uh, uh, ecosystem and rape their mothers. Every other, you know, uh, 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 indigenous people in this contraption, Mazen Nandakan is fighting for all of us. And that is why uh, Chuku Kabi name will be praised. And on this platform, as they heard this evening, and so they bring and give you, I intended to have this program only but for two hours. And now I have only about three minutes to round up. Any call that comes, that comes now is going to be the last caller of the day. Any call that I answer now shall be the last for the day. Because Mazi, um, if, if I enjoy four, have a uh, you know, told us exactly what is happening in regards to Mazen Namdekanu case. He updated us. He kept us posted. And he told us that Mazen Namdekanu is very, very strong. He's very, very healthy, physically, spiritually, and otherwise. He is indeed, you know, strong. I think somebody is about to join me. I don't know. Obasi. Obasi uh, Emmanuel or somebody. Uh, Mazi, uh, Obasi, please, if you're not wearing your clothes, I cannot bring you out. Put on your shirt. I can't bring you out without putting on a shirt, without putting on a, on a cloth. I cannot. Please, I want you to put on your shirt. Mazi or Basi Manuel. If you are not putting on clothes, I can't bring you on this camera because the world is watching. The world is watching. By the way, I'm about to close the program. So if you can't put on a shirt, you come out, you know, bare naked, I cannot bring you up because we don't you know, welcome that on this platform. Dear friends, I want to remind you that on Monday, coming Monday is going to be a sit at home. It's going to be a ghost town in every part of Biafra land. Edo State, Delta State, Bayasa State, River State, Cross River State, Akwaibom State, Anambra State, Enugu State, Eboin State, Imo State, Abia State, Lower Kogi, Lower Benue, 
these are states that makes up that makes up of Biafra. If the enemy say I am, if they say otherwise, or they say I am lying, let them come and bring. Okay, let them let them give us, let them give us uh, uh, opportunity to vote, which is uh, president. Let them consult a referendum. Once they do it, we shall know if all these places I mentioned is Biafra or not. Because anyone who say you are the, they are not part and parcel of this movement, they can go and stay with the Nigeria and keep suffering, because Biafra is going to be a great nation. And on this note, I say mechuko kikabi ama primeni ne ezeni nene ni guagne na pona na nandena kogosi ani mabola yuzo mabela yazo kocha kubo kwa yicho kwa bumbu Biafra onya fruta taka fuiechi ana masi forma mele madu ya mekuwa mwani ya aina si onya bona jimgo ma wena eko ni ya kwana kuya mande jimgo jo wena eko ana masi ya kwana diko ha ebo beru go beru kesi biebe na ya gosi ebo gebe chuko kabi ama biko do 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 chela imazen namde kano chuko kumu biafra ni nebe nke hano ndena gani jemo poluzo ndena gani ubo loko ndena gani ubo elo ndena gani ubo ne kreja ndena gani ubo mili biko duna yuko na kuko jo bo haiga diko kichi ma kichi ada wagu onye sukwa na yana fayo fu na yana fayo fu fayo bumbu biafra ona bo le yapita kwa nazo chuko kabi ama biko esi ni hobo na kai ona hagi ni gemera iya ni inka anamasi ka iho ma mero muke mekwara mwania biko no kodi Thank you very, very much, dear friends. I want to call it a day. Tomorrow, I'm coming to you once again to bring another beautiful program to you. If you are watching this program from any of these platforms, please endeavor to share it. Share, share, share. And make sure you tell your people at home to sit at home because Biafra is our last home. Thank you so much. I love you all. <laughs>